What is going on guys and girls, it's Ghost Robo, and uh, a lot of people have requested, and I have agreed to that request of making something, cooking something that's actually a legit thing to eat. Not that those other things weren't especially delicious, but they kind of resulted in some disasters. So, um, I figured I would make something that I drink slash eat pretty much every day. Um, it is a protein drink smoothie that is all natural, all organic, all thousand million percent Ghost Robo approved, and I think super good. Um, I'm an incredibly picky eater, I'm incredibly like sugar addicted, like I love good tasting stuff, so it's very hard for me to find um, protein drinks or, or things that are very nutritional that I enjoy and like. And this is something that's like, ah, oh my god, like right away just tasted like ice cream to me. So I'm going to go through the process, I've got a nice, I'm sitting down here because it's kind of the easiest way to, to show and record at the same time, and my kitchen is a mess, but that's the real world, so good luck. Um, I have a bunch of random ingredients here, and we will find out which ones comprise the Ghost Robo. I'm um, actually actually let's call it the Prototype Two smoothie, since that's the, the big game on the horizon for us. Um, I'll be finishing up a couple things in the next day or so, and then we'll be starting Prototype Two Monday, eleven fifty nine, twelve a.m. Tuesday, early morning, late night, however you want to classify it. But uh, I'm I'm super excited. I've been playing the game. It's been a lot of fun, and uh, there's some cool stuff going on with each episode as well. So. Stay tuned that. Right now, let's make our very own prototype smoothie on camera for you. So the first thing we need is organic... No, I'm kidding. We're not going to do that this time. We're not going to make a disgusting thing. We're actually going to make a legit thing. So the first thing we need is our blender, obviously. And the very first portion of this is coconut milk. Now, I, 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 for, I'm, I'm lactose intolerant. I don't eat dairy. So I've experimented with coconut milk, rice milk, tons of different milks along the way. And the one that's best for this kind of a drink, that's going to give you the best like flavor and everything, is going to be coconut milk. So we're going to add 8 ounces of this. I'm just going to make a single drink. Normally I make this like double or triple for uh, me and my brothers or me and my girlfriend or uh, everybody in the entire family, my dog, whatever. Um, so coconut milk's the first thing. The next imp most important thing probably is the protein powder. Um, this is called Terra's Whey and it is very, very, very good, delicious, um, organic whey protein. Um, you can get this at like Whole Foods or any kind of natural, local, organic store probably. I don't know, it's kind of expensive, kind of hard to find, but um, I like it a lot. So we'll open this up again one-handed here. Everything is kind of tricky. I shall bear with me. I'm going to uh, try to scoop it out here. Scoop. That's not a very good scoop. Not a good scoop. That's a good scoop. Okay. So I scoop it in and put it in one scoop. And we're going to go two scoops here. Um, I don't know what's in the background. So if you see my brother, he's probably waving at you right now. Um, and two scoops. Bam. Okay. So we have two scoops of that. Now, what do we need next? There's a lot of things behind us. We have dressings. We have... You know, sesame oil, we have salsa, we have salt, we have tuna, but the uh, the next thing we're going to put in is some fruit. So I like to mix these protein drinks with fruit um, because one, it adds flavor, two, it adds, it's kind of a morning thing. Uh, fruit is really best in the morning. Um, that's not just like, hey, hey fruit's good in the morning. It's like for like health and stuff, it's really the best time to eat it. Um, so I, I'm going to make this a, a berry mixed uh, drink. So we're going to add a whole bag of frozen strawberries. Um, these are, I'll show you, these ones are from Trader Joe's. I do most of our shopping at at Trader Joe's um, and Whole Foods. Okay, so these are Trader Joe's organic frozen strawberries. I'm gonna add the entire bag here. Da -da 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 -da. You, you could warm these up if you want them to get a little soft if your blender's not very good, but I'm with the amount we're making, actually I'm just gonna put not the whole bag, a little, just a lot less since I'm just making one drink here. Um, you probably don't need to warm them up if you have a solid blender. Uh, what's next? Probably the next thing is a banana. Let's, let's open this banana one-handed. Um, if we can manage to make this work here. Um, this is something that I found probably, my mom actually found for us like two, three months ago. And, and ever since it's been like delicious and what, what I, I just crave all the time because one, it's good for you, super good for you. And two, it's uh, absolutely delicious. And you can make it thicker, thinner to your taste. It kind of goes from like smoothie to ice cream based on what you want. So I'm going to put this banana in here um, as best I can. I'm getting it all over my pants, which is just freaking lovely. Ew, banana string! I, do you have, like banana strings? I don't really like them. We're not going to put that in. Gross. Bananas in. Uh, okay, so next, if you could be like, what else could this need? It needs some more fruit. So what we're going to do is we're going to put in some frozen mango. Now this bag is already open. That's why they're in bags like this. Because um, I figured I probably can't rip thick plastic with one hand. So we'll dump a little bit of mango in. Uh, there's no real set amount with this. It's just kind of like two-year tasting. Um, again, this is just one... One serving, so I'm going to make it kind of a smaller size. And what we're going to do here is the blender is super freaking loud. So as you can see, no, we don't need tropical mango, even though it's my favorite salad dressing. No, we don't need avocados, even though they're super good for you. No, we don't need salt, even though I use it all the time. No, we don't need any of this other stuff. I'm going to blend this all up. It's a super loud blender, so I'll blend it, and then we'll get back and show you what it looks like, and I will uh, give you my final thoughts. Okay, so we're done blending. It was a very quick process. Probably all in all, this drink takes 
three to five minutes to make. You can add almond butter. Um, you could add peanut butter, I guess, but I use almond butter because it's, it's healthier for you, better for your organic, natural, blah, blah, blah. Um, and to add a little bit of extra protein, add a little bit of extra thickness, or just texturize it slightly, depending on what you like. Uh, like I said, you can make it thicker, thinner, but let's see what it looks like. Um, again, our prototype's too smoothie. Remember, coconut milk, protein, whey protein powder, some frozen strawberries, some frozen mango, and some... That's it. Very simple. Very simple. One, milk, powder, fruit, fruit, banana. Five things. Okay, we're good. Ready to see this? Here's what we got. Here's our lovely blender, and inside you can see our delicious drink is ready for consumption. So, I'm going to set this on my lap here, and we're going to pull out what we've made. Let's put it right nicely. Oh, jeez. Right here, ta-da, ready? Do 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 do. Look at that smoothie! Oh, it's so full of protein. It's so full of protein, and, and it's it's got its own prototype too, Flair. You can see. Um, it you I mean I didn't do the greatest job of of making the design perfect, but it, it came out nicely for just using a blender. You know, if we use like a a hand blender, maybe it would have been better. But it, it's pretty it's pretty good prototype too smoothie. All right, just kidding, guys. This is actually what it made. Um. Mm -hmm. So yummy, you taste some. Ready? I'll give you, have a taste. Is that good? Do you like it? Is that good? Good, good, good? Okay. So this is basically what it makes enough, again, it actually made, my little brother over here is chilling with his own glass over there. It actually made two glasses, even though I only intended to make one. Which is kind of the cool thing about these kind of protein drinks and smoothies is they always end up making a lot more than you think because a little bit of powder, a little bit of milk, then you add the fruit and you add all that other stuff, especially if you add almond butter or something. All of a sudden, boom, you have a really big drink. Which is great. It's super healthy, super delicious, super amazing. Again, I, you want another sip? Okay. It's so good. It's so good. Mmm. So yummy. And uh, I love it. I hope you enjoyed actually a legit cooking video from me for once. And uh, something that's really healthy and unique kind of to Ghost Robo. Uh, Prototype 2 does come out Monday night. I hope you guys will support it. And hope you guys will be there excited for some fun. Uncharted 3 wrapping up very quickly. Uh, probably going to get another series wrapped up very quickly here too. And then start Prototype 2. I'm going to try something new out where I do a little cool thing every episode. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see how you guys like that. I think it should be pretty awesome. I'm really excited. It's a very cool game. Like I said, obviously, you know I have it, and I've been playing it, and it's it's pretty darn, darn fun, and I, and I think it makes really entertaining videos, especially with my commentary. So, hope you guys are excited for that in probably like 36 hours, or less, 24 hours by now. But either way, until next time, have a fantastic day. If you want more cooking or more recipes or more things for me, um, I can incorporate those uh, regularly if, it, if it's something that people like. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day. hope you had a fantastic weekend. And until next time, guys and girls, we will see you all. Later.